Tosi Pombanjo, of course, up with the uh, Guinea president, Alpha Conde, in Davos at the WEF meeting this last week. She asked him about the outcome of his meeting with IMF president, Christine Lagarde. Let's take a look. Oui, la Forme monétaire, Mme Christine Lagarde, a montré de très bonnes dispositions pour nous accompagner, non seulement pour mettre fin à l'Ebola, mais pour l'après Ebola. Donc, euh, la banque, le Forme monétaire est bien disposé. We have the full support of the IMF, uh, not only for the fight against Ebola, but also for our economic situation and the recoveries of our economy. Mr. President, that, does this mean that we are on track to possibly see a cancellation of debt that uh, Guinea has on its books for now? Uh, notre combat, c'est obtenir l'annulation de la dette pour les trois pays, libérer un salaire en Guinée. Et nous pensons que l'Union africaine va nous soutenir pour l'annulation de la dette bilatérale et multilatérale pour les trois pays. It is our current battle, um, not only for Guinea, but for all three countries. We have the support of the African Union, and we are hopeful. Mr. President, maybe you could give us an indication of how Guinea is uh, coming back uh, from an economic point of view, given the impact uh, that the Ebola crisis has had on the e economy as a whole. Évidemment, la Guinée était très bien partie pour 2015. Malheureusement, l'Ebola a eu beaucoup d'impact sur notre économie. Maintenant, notre bataille, c'est de mettre fin à l'Ebola, renforcer notre système sanitaire et avoir un appui sérieux sur le plan de l'aide budgétaire pour redémarrer l'économie et le retour des investisseurs. 2015 was about to be a very good year for Guinea on the economic front. Unfortunately, Ebola has come to slow things down. Now our goal is to fight Ebola until we get zero cases. The next stage will obviously be the recovery of our economy. And, um, and the final question, Mr. President, as we are on the road to recovery, what are you telling investors? Which sectors are you supporting from a policy perspective to attract further investment? C'est surtout dans le secteur de l'énergie, le secteur des infrastructures, le secteur de l'agriculture, le secteur de l'industrie et le secteur des mines. Primarily energy, infrastructure, mines agriculture. and agriculture. Et le tourisme et l'industrie. Tourism and industry as well. Mr. President, thank you so much for your time.